Question 11 from the National 5 Physics paper from 2018 assesses our understanding of the difference between AC, uh, which is alternating current, and DC, which is direct current circuits. So let's go through each of these statements and see if they're correct or not. In an AC circuit, the direction of the current regularly changes or changes regularly. That is true. AC means alternating current, which means the charges all move in one direction and then they change direction and all move in the other direction. They go back and forth, to and fro. Part 2. In a DC circuit, that's direct current, negative charges flow in one direction only. Well, negative charges is correct because they are electrons and they all flow in the same direction. So that's also correct. And then finally, part 3. In an AC circuit, the size of the current varies with time. This one's a little bit more difficult but it is also correct as well and the reason for that is because when we look at the um, the wave from an AC signal if we just draw a quick graph here to show what the wave looks like the voltage is constantly rising and falling. It's not a very good graph but you get the idea this is voltage on this axis here and this is time on that axis. So if the voltage is constantly changing, becoming positive and then negative, that means the amount of push on the charges is also changing. So whenever the voltage is at a, the greatest point there, the push will be greatest, but maybe down here the push will be slightly less. And so therefore the size of the current, the amount of flow of charge, uh, the rate of flow of charge, uh, changes with time. So all three of those are correct, and so therefore the answer has to be E.